camp is really a battle, but it's a lot of fun at the same time. You know, early mornings, kind of long, late days, but it's really just an opportunity to play football for one, uh, get to know your teammates and learn the game of football and just really get to bond with each other and have some fun, meet new people, get closer with the team, get closer with the coaches, but it's really like a, I would kind of say like a, a team retreat before the season. Today we have a double day, so we'll be back here after our break, you know, get have position meetings, have special teams meetings, get prepped for the next practice, and then we'll head onto the field. Uh, we have walkthrough every day at 6.30 a.m., and then we probably, we have a couple hours of break between everything, but um, we don't get done usually until about 7.30 p.m., so it's, I mean, it's a long day. Well, you get into a routine, so after like day four, day five, you're like, you're into it, you know what's going on, so like waking up in the morning kind of just becomes like a, a habit, it's not like that much harder after the first week or whatever, so. that the conditions are tough. I like it, it's hot. It's gonna be hotter this afternoon. We wanna see who can really focus when it's tough. And you know what, if this game was easy, everybody would be playing it. And there's 50,000 people in Grand Forks today and about, what, 100 guys out here and maybe about 60 at each high school that chose to play football. The rest are relaxing in the basement. It's tough, but we are going to be a tough team, you understand that? When the conditions are tough, that's when we got to be at our best. 